create new symphony project web app as a demo symphony now is going to install all required dependencies to start this project let's step into that directory and let's look our new created directory and as we see here symphony already included docker file let's clear and symphony console make entity product a property for our entity name length we just leave everything per default another property let's put price float another property let's now put is active and as you see here symphony already guessed the type of this is active it's a boolean that's beautiful let's continue let's create a crude for this entity symphony console make crude the class name of course product autocomplete works beautiful a crude created ladies and gentlemen now let's initialize our database and our email server just simply using docker compose app in the daemon and bam a database server started an email server started let's go continue then symphony console migration we create a migration and let's now execute sql query against our database to create this product crude we already created together so we do symphony console doctrine migration migrate you are about to execute migration in the database yes of course continue and finish it one migration executed nine sql queries this is beautiful our application is ready now let's run our server and let's check it out come on symphony serve in the background all right our server is working open our chrome and let's put the product and bam we have a product page create new product name ios phone price 99999 is active no save and we created a product a real product in our database let's create another one android phone price 999 is active yes yes it's created we have two products real in our database let's delete this one bam no overhead at all html form php request processing security validation database transaction and really much more and i did not write any line of code and no i'm not being paid to say this Go and check the description, see the comment and write me what you think. Like the video and subscribe to my channel. Then go to the channel, check the videos and like each one of them and comment again. And come back to this video and watch it again. Thank you.